Greetings Guardians and welcome to another Planet Destiny video. In this video we're going to be having a sniff at the weapon tuning update notes that were published on Bungie.net earlier today. If you'd like to give the article a read for yourself then the link is down in the description. For this video we'll be specifically going through the upcoming changes to exotic weaponry. The changes to all the legendary weapon categories will be covered in a separate video as it's a very big subject and deserves a whole video all to itself. So stay tuned for that as it's coming soon. Soon. The first exotic on the list of changes is Fabian Strategy. This is the Titan specific auto rifle. Doubling down on a Titan's role to hold the front line, Fabian Strategy users will now be able to hold down the trigger to melt enemies until there are none left. Kills with this weapon now automatically load a portion of the magazine and the base range has been increased by 16% and the stability has been increased by 44%. Next on the list is everyone's favourite year one hand cannon, Thorn. Bungie say since we're bringing this back for Rise of Iron, it was worth re-evaluating its place in the weapon ecosystem. To avoid a repeat of year one, Thorn's base range has been reduced by 25%. Next on the list is everybody's favourite one banger, the Universal Remote. Many of you are going to be quite glad to see that this thing's getting a nerf. The exotic perk range bonus is being reduced by 75% and it no longer guarantees maximum shotgun range. The Uni Remote has also had its rate of fire increased but this will lower the damage as a secondary effect. The Drex Promise is getting a wee buff, the damage is being increased by 8% and the magazine size is being increased by 3. There are some changes to the Touch of Malice exotic scout rifle. Bungie say that it was intended to be the shiniest weapon in the King's Fall, but outside of the raid, clever players figured out how to avoid Touch of Malice's single drawback by imbuing themselves with the Blessing of Light. So Touch of Malice's self-damage infliction now removes Blessing of Light. We have another small buff to exotic scout rifle Boolean Gemini. This super versatile weapon receives another tool in its kit with added intrinsic perk high caliber rounds. And the final weapon tweak goes to the exotic pulse rifle, no time to explain. Apparently this is to be respected in the spirit of the weapon by adding the intrinsic perk Headseeker. Hmm, interesting. I've been Story Machine, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then you can slap the indicator of the upward thumb. If you happen to enjoy my own personal ramblings, then feel free to visit me on my own channel. The link is on screen and in the description. Remember to stay tuned for the upcoming video on all of the legendary weapon category changes there. Until the next time though, folks, smoke us a kipper. We'll be back for breakfast.